I think it is time to tackle a main mission. We're doing all right in uh, Watson. There's obviously still stuff to do, lots of stuff to do, but uh, I want to get going because I want to unlock some cars and do some other stuff. So need to progress the story a little bit for that. And then we'll go back to side missions. Oh, I'm supposed to call someone. Hang on a sec. Before we do that. Yeah. Let's uh Hey, my car's not in the way. You can get around. Well you know what you can wait. Um nope. Okay. Sorry. What do you want? <laughs> Alright, so if we're gonna do the pickup. And then I want to get all get this uh, Meredith, Meredith Stout piece covered as well. So let's, let's see what. I, oh wait. Message. Oh. Okay, I already picked up that. Uh, I want to get back to. Yep. Let's find out what happens here. out here. Start by telling me how you got this number. No more than your number. Heard you misplaced the convoy. You shut him up. Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Transport fuck-up's toxic for you, I know. So listen carefully. You and me are gonna meet. See if we can't find a way to help each other out. Mutual self-interest. Agreed. First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm Channel under the overpass. Meet you there. Okay. Well, let's go we meet with, uh... Meredith. I'm sure this will go well. Hello? Lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? Yep, that was me. Wait, where's the... Hey. Okay. Thought you could blackmail me, fucker! Set conditions! Got any more for me? Calm the fuck down! I just wanna talk! Christ, Meredith! Shut your trap! That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly. Are you here alone? I'll tell you who's alone. You. Fail to recover that transport and you're done. With not a soul willing to help. Not another word. Do a sweep now. Now listen, please. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? Got no ties to Militech. None. Check it out. So how the fuck do you know so much? Come on. All corps use the same playbook. I know the game inside out. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... <sighs> him you can let go. I want to hear what he has to say. Couldn't have been chill from the start. Shut the fuck up. Tell me what you want. I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force. But they're expecting payment. So I could go that route too. Fine. The latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money.
That the kind of subtlety they teach at Melotech? Chip spiked with a virus, clearly. That is true. Something goes wrong, I'm the one they'll fill full of holes, not you. Time you were straight with me. What's on there? A tracing algorithm. Latches on to financial streams. Nothing you need to worry your head about. Sounds solid enough. I'm in. You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to fuck me in any way, and I'll... Mm, well, I can't read that yet, but, um... Oh, there's a crack security option. I'll be seeing you real soon. All right. <clears throat> You're making a mistake. The cops are any good as dead. But she'll take you down with her. That definitely was not a uh, pleasant experience. And you bet we're going to try to remove the virus from the chip. And I'm actually going to do that right now. You got six moves to get this. Okay, all right, hold on. I think we got this. So it needs to go, all right. So I should go BD, BD, FF, 55, 1C E9. Right. Okay. Eddie's on the cred ship are clean. Oh. So I got it. Nice. Let's get going. Ah, there you are. Let me hear what you squared away. Been waiting long. Mi madre always said patience pays off, so. Z Bug show any sign of life? You two talk? She's up to date and fired up to work with Dex. Preparing already. They're familiar, you know? Worked together before Dex took his break. So Dex already paid the Maelstrom for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the Gangoons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? Militech and me, we found some common ground. They're footing the bill for the bot. There's a lot of scratch to toss away. Forget it, Jack. It would be like we never had it in the first place. Anyway, who knows how this deal's gonna shake out. So, into the Borg Beast then? Give me a minute. Okay, tell me when you're good and steeled. Just in case I mess up. Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. Lead the way, Jackie. I hate these Borg fuckers. Just had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? I take the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Go on, let them know we're here. Uh. Ow. Ring a oh. ding ding chum. Gotta get this done. <sighs> Don't know you. Wanna talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting.
Okay. Uh, cozy place. You could use a few plants, though. Oh, yeah. They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in a chow factory. Uh, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. You hear about their boss, Royce? Dex mentioned him. <laughs> Called him special. Well, just me and us, Holmes. Shit. They expected a whole Militech platoon? Got a bad feeling creeping up my spine, Jack. Yeah, well, these guys are a bit more than just naughty boys. More minds? Seriously. T0 D12 called the Flathead. And the hell you care. Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch. Planet. Okay. Uh oh. I'm awkwardly like not figuring out where to sit. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Uh, well shit. Goes for you too. I'll stand. This so fucking hard? Fucking ass on the fucking couch! Make me. Oh jeez. Thought you never ask. Sit your ass down, Jack. Planet. Sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but... Shit. Well... All right. Come on. Got to lighten up. Take a hit. What is it? It's Keef. Shit kicks you in the ass. It's a fucking rush, man. Gotta feel it for yourself. Come on, give it a whirl. Thanks, I'm good. Whatever you say, straight edged prince. <laughs> Here we go. The flathead. Model MT Zero D twelve. Militech's not gonna come looking for it? Fuck them. They can hop around and try. We'll remove the serial number and lift in access locks using our soft. Once it's yours, it's yours. All right. Need to see it. Sue yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimp down prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this. Fully integrated link too. So when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm -hmm. Could lose your lunch. So what you think? Yep, we'll take it. Free. Sure. Yeah. Let's see a cred. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Brick got it. I don't see any fucking.
fucking brick around here, do you? Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice because I say you'll pay twice. Alright. You want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Seeing as you already got the eddies for it. What to offer us a discount? A big one. A discount? Fuck. Uh, you know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> and he ain't dead? No. He's alive, well, and Sends his regards. So you're gonna consider my offer now? Here's the cred. Hell, I'll even toss in some info as a friendly bonus. Militech's on to you. They're close. Wait, what? Cred chip was spiked with a virus. Don't worry. I wiped it. and get the fuck out of my factory. If this is a trick, I'm gonna introduce you to our meat for. grunt. Nova, so now leave. And hey, after you get Dex's dick out of your mouth, tell him I say hello. <laughs> Piece of shit. Something tells me they weren't a fan of me uh, wiping that. Militech couldn't manage it on the slide with the chips, so they rolled in the big guns. More their fucking style, I'd say. All right. Takes me to loot everything, buddy. Hey, Dudom, or whatever your name is. Are you even helping us? I'm not helping start from here. Alright, well... Just gonna let them kill each other for a little bit. No reason to get our hands dirty. For now. Doesn't mean we'll get involved later. Plus, well, they seem to be handling this all right. Ladies and 
gentlemen, Jackie Come Webb. On, There we go. All right. You know who you're messing with. Wait, which one's the bad guy? This guy? My bad guy. I don't. I mean, they're all bad guys. The current opponents, to be more exact. Now. Permit me some looting, because uh, stuff ain't cheap, you know. What's in here? Shard? Okay. Some terminal stuff here. Less than ideal, but Jackie, don't get yourself burned. It's not advisable. Shoot me! Oh. Through the code. Hold on a sec. Don't have an authorization. You're here. I know you are. Remote deactivation. Disarm it. I can do this. God, felt like a fucking eternity. There's been in here a while. A few days. Kind of lost count. Some yeah, guys low enough to care slipping stuff. Tried to help out. Boys threw him in the microwave dryer. Made me watch. I guess it's kind of your fault we're here. Came for some tech, Dex bought. He tell you to free me? No, I'm not out the body. Classic fucking Dex. <laughs> Looking a little like we might have saved your skin. I think we'll do a favor, hombre. Jesus, slow down, baby. I'll get you. What kind of coffee you have in time? <laughs> really? We ever meet again, I'll have you covered. <gasps> All right. Let's get Let's out of here. Go! Time to leave. Let's go. See a data shard right here. You guys aren't gonna move without me, huh? No, oh, never mind, they're moving. Oh, 
kind of just chilling here. What are you guys, uh... Oh, jeez. Okay, let me get out of the way. Son, let me... So, goon. Oh, never mind. Not enemy friendly. This guy is not. And neither are these guys. He has no right to leave. Alright. Oh, cameras don't get care. Uh, we need to head this way. Oh, look, another data shard. Okay. Well. Oh. Data shard. Take that. Take that. More fighting happening downstairs. Is there any consequence for... Doing this? Nope. How do I get down there without dying? Oh, probably the stairs, huh? Anything interesting this way? Cards. Yes. Brilliant. Sorry, guys. Just uh, doing some more looting. Looting. Hello. Don't mind me. Wait, wait, I don't have a good light of sight. Go, go, go! Is our friend not wanting to come out? I'll get him. Goodbye. Anything else? No? That's kind of it, huh? On the back of cards. You guys can keep that. Uh. Do we? Wait, can I? No, there's nothing I can do with these guys. Uh oh, I think I got his attention. You guys aren't doing anything, really? Come on, guys. Got work to do.
I really want to finish him off with a sword swing. There we go. Is there more than one? Oh, there's some goons. Oh, jeez. His voice down. Hey. Yeah, it looks like voice is down. Let's get out of here. Could have gone a little better. Here you go. I can't fucking believe that guy. Hmm. Okay. Moves, what did I get? Chaos. It's an iconic weapon. It must be Royce's. It's a lot better than what I have. Don't mind if I do. Nice. This is mine now. Um, anything else I can pick up? Uncommon items. Royce was a little on the edge anyway. Alright, now we can leave. Go Jackie. Come on, V. Let's get out of here. Vanilla dick. He got those things buzzing around everywhere. Past the gate. We can talk there. Hold He's your coming fire. for me. I'm sure this will be fun to explain. You shot at my people. You know this guy? Anthony Gilchrist. Still alive. And not hogtied for a change. Have a good memory for names. But that's nowhere near enough when Militech personnel get shot up. They drew and fired first fact of no consequence to Militech management. But if you'd worked with Stout, I'd be dead by now. Might not have intended it, but you saved my life. Now I'm saving yours. Makes us even. Gotta admit, didn't expect to see you here. You were followed, but I'm sure you know that. Stout's people were on your tail, my people were on theirs. In the end, she lost her nerve. Thought she hopped in bed with Maelstrom behind her back. Hit the big red button prematurely. Classic. When you don't know what to do, why not order an all-out assault on a food factory? Mm-hmm. About sums it up. I made sure it blew up in her face. Business with Maelstrom. Hardly ever ends well, does it? What happened to Stout? She placed some bad bets. Her clock ran out. Simple as that. Suffice to say, you won't be seeing her again. Oh. And you? Why are you here? Well, I still don't know who the mole is. I was hoping the Maelstromers would shed some light on it. Yeah, I doubt that. Pretty tough to get corpses to talk. You'd be surprised. I'm sure I'll manage something. It's been a pleasure. Okay then. Good luck with that mess. Holy shit, V. I wasn't sure we'd walk out in one piece. We make a good team, Jack. I think you might be right. In any case, I don't regret switching my life up the way I did. Now that'd be the sweet taste of success, my friend. 
Hey, call up Dex. Let him know we got his toy. Meeting to celebrate at the afterlife. How you luego, B? All right. How things looking, Mr. B? Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure, of course there's trouble. Royce couldn't have given two shits that you and Brick had shaken on. How'd you get him on board? You use the Corpo woman? Met with Stout, managed to strike a deal. Well, well. Gave me the chip with the scratch from Maelstrom. I warned Royce. We made a deal. You got some balls, Mr. B. What about the meet with Evelyn Parker? Still on the to-do list. Mm -hmm. That meet's the only thing that'll get you a chance at grabbing that chip. Parker will be waiting for you at Lizzie's bar. Good luck. Hmm, okay. Well, I'd say that was pretty successful. Could have gone a little better, but uh, hey, got the job done. Got Royce's weapon, which I'm pretty stoked about. And uh, yeah, Let's say that that uh, went all right. Level up. Got two perk points this time. What do I have to do to get more better cold blood stuff? I, it so, seems like it's time for me to start putting perk points in here if I really want some uh, benefits. Meanwhile, in reflexes. Yeah, well. Blades are looking all right. Increases bleed duration. It's like the next set of stuff I can get is a level 12, which is either trigger, which Okay, I see. Bleeding is now healing, which is nice. Um, with body and athletics, there's really not a whole lot I'm interested in. Here, I mean, max health is nice, max stamina is nice, carrying capacity increase is always good. Health regeneration is not bad. Intelligence, I think I'm... I can still get perk put in perk points, but I'm not really interested in any other demons. So, I think, I think these are all, all I need. Maybe the biosynergy perk. But, um... Stealth. Crit chance. Not, that's not bad, actually. Yeah, I think I think I'm gonna buy some some uh, cool perk points. It's it's either two in reflexes and then putting more more stuff in blade. Oh, actually, this I'm getting. I need armor increase. Yeah, for sure. And then these ones I'm not too interested in yet. So I think. The next perk that I would like is Little Seven is Assassin. Well, that's not bad actually. Trigger. Movement speed increases. Yeah, okay, we're gonna put the next two perk points in cool. So. Or attribute points, sorry, not perk points. One. Two. And now, we've got some more options. This is good. Or... Uh, 
Yeah, I need to invest in cobalt. But this I'm going to pick up now. Move a little faster. Okay. We need to complete this next thing because I feel like it. Looking a little put out there, input. Interest you in a preem BD? Not my first time. Don't remember you. So I didn't get in through the front. Huh, get a load of this one. Right. Rules are simple. Someone catches your eye, you do not grab. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. No recording, no copping feels when the guards ain't looking. In you go. Have fun, input. Welcome to Lizzie's. I just called. An input? My, what a sweet little face you have. Thanks. Made it myself. Definitely a vibe. Data shard. Hey. Get you something. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here. Who was asking? Big tipper. Generous when I get the answers I'm looking for. I appreciate the gesture, truly. But afraid I don't get paid to talk. Opposite. It's all right, Mateo. Hello. Oh, he's born drinks. Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Why not say hello soon? I wanted to get a good look at you first. Why are we meeting here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing, this place. Mm -hmm. Hmm. I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone ask? We're not here. So, what? Nothing's wrong. Yeah, really? Why don't you just tell me the truth? Okay. I just told you. Awkward silence. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. You don't give a rat's dick what Dex thinks. We both know that. You have trouble accepting compliments? No, just think flattery's beneath you. Am I wrong? Maybe Dex is beneath you. Have you known each other long? You write in Dex's bio? Hate to disappoint, but I just don't know much. In other words, you hardly know each other. Yet he fingered you for this job. Hmm. Huh. Curious. Shit, buzz Dex right now if you're getting cold feet. I can wait. I doubt he'd add anything I haven't already heard. Anything I'd really like to hear for that matter. There's only one other bunch that's worse than fixers in that respect. Used car salesmen. <laughs> I'll go with my gut for now. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. 
Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka, making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Arasaka seems to have quite the touch with that hotel chain. But I gotta say, Compeki in Tokyo is still leagues above the rest. The two are identical to each other. Japan staff, huh? The service can't be beat. Singapore, Paris, Washington. All the rest act like charity case cousins by comparison. Well, it's hard to argue with that, true. So where's this chip hiding exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? In Night City? <laughs> Guess the scream sheets weren't lying this time. It's on the lips of everyone in the city. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son, heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire, in town. <laughs> Please. Could it be? Emperor's prepared to cede his throne after 150 years? <laughs> Doubt it. Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Top dog like Yorinobu's bound to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yorinobu keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Huh. Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka himself. <sighs> Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yuri's balls in a vice for years. He might just turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. Even so, it's still Yorinobu fucking Arasaka. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your prick perk up. <laughs> Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Nope, don't buy it. Netwatch's integrity rests on their neutrality. Why would they tarnish their rep by procuring stolen goods? Netwatch provides net security for all corporations, and collects eddies in the millions for it. But in this day and age, everyone's in the game. And no one can afford to be a saint. To win, one has to go all in. So what's your Nobu do to walk away with? Unimportant. You focus on the biochip. What could cyberspace's watches and protectors offer him? Intelligence on his enemies? That doesn't matter in the least. Because you'll make sure the transaction never happens and I get the chip. Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Heard a bit about Yorinobu. Study finance and biotech in Tokyo. Probably to please his father. Mm-hmm. Saburo was grooming him to be his successor. But then Yorinobu cut himself off from the corp. Joined the Steel Dragons, nomads from Tokyo. Heard they were planning an Arasaka coup, or its downfall. Hmm. That flash of youthful rebellion ended like it usually does. Yorinobu returned to the fold, but the bitter taste remained. You know your stuff. But that's only one side of him. There's another. An intelligent man who has his own designs on the corp. Could be another power-hungry corpo dick. 
like so many others. <laughs> Ever tried to imagine what life might be like for an emperor's son? You have everything, yet you are no one. Nothing. At least as long as you remain in Saburo Arasaka's shadow. I... sympathize. It's a vulnerability I understand well. And one you plan to exploit fully. One more thing. Data that's on the chip. What is it? Irrelevant. Entirely. We're talking about data Yorinobu snuck out of Arasaka. What's more, he wants to pass it on to Netwatch. Sounds pretty damn relevant to me. Listen, V. The relic. That's my concern. Your concern? Earning a paycheck. Just get the job done. I'll make sure your bank accounts are sated. Sounds fair enough to me. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Uh. In facts, not thrills. <laughs> Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits? Jacking off to in those boxes? No. It can be a very useful tool. What? Good for Would you analyzing like details, Sweet, human sure. perception, okay. even boosted. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, all right. Exactly all what right. you need. Mm -hmm. so what's on the tape? Mm -hmm. All right. Yorinobu's suite. The glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? Supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You know each other? How else could I get all this intel? I know him pretty well, actually. We have an arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Besides, we go back, uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, mm -hmm. not the latest member of your crew. Yeah, yeah, I'll see ya. Try not to forget. So, you'll be a good boy. Tread lightly. All right, and keep Mom. that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. This is V. He's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Gonna make me barf. Impressive looking setup. Need all this to process brain dances. Mm-hmm. Analyzers, sensory SIG amps, acoustic and emotive wave monitors, facial expression translators. <clears throat> Judy. All right, all right. Piled your BD yet. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw, but yeah, ought to do. Mm hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. Should see the jig jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside. Let him look, let him rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? Look, I'm no BD virgin, but the raw stuff? Uncharted territory. Relax, I'll explain everything. It's less complicated than it sounds. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Create your sensory profile first. A 
What profile now? A model of your perceptions and emotional responses. Need to adjust that so the raw BD won't overwhelm you. If I don't, best case scenario, you'll get nauseous as soon as you're in. Probably barf like you would in a shoddy virtue environment. Yay. Mm -hmm. And worst case? Your synapses sizzle like locusts in a deep fryer. Oh, sweet. But we're not about to let that happen. Nah. Okay. Hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm -hmm. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Get a lot of requests like this? All the time. But it's usually stuff the girls scroll at the club. I take that and do some routine porn tuning. Crank up the orgasms? More like cut out all the other shit. Fucking's business as usual for these guys. Their minds wander to grocery lists, spouses' birthdays, late bills, whatever. But even then, you can refigure things, mold the emotions into something unique, unforgettable. So, I can't complain. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. You need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Where could we... <sighs> Can't he just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Besides, won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. What you choose? Corner store hold up in Haywood. Real amateurs. Don't even know where I got it. Suits our needs perfectly, though. You ready? Boot it up. All right, let's do this. Mm -hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. Then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in in three, two, one. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Now, everybody, on the ground. What I see you kissing the flooring. Money now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Whoa, yeah, uh, hey! Uh, now, before I blow your fucking head off! Ah! Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. That flash of intense shock. I can still feel it, I remember. Fuck, that last second. You could have warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about that. You'll be fine. Got everything set up? Let's switch over to editing mode. Sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array, you'll be able to look around freely. Whole scene's yours. Full cam control in analysis mode, so move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash... Get out, and we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream is hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind. Roll it back to the top. All good. Neat. 
Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. You simply need those like reasons. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat, the gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in. That's your cash. Get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Okay, right here. Analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Fuck! On your ah, little shitheads! Go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously. Like what's happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Don't restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, okay. eh? We have a deal today on two flavors. Cuddy and yeah. Serpent. Everybody! Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller's cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared. Meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. Hella nice. Now, let's wait till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. On the ground! You wanna see you kissing the flooring? Money! Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. Alright, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Now, or I will fucking drop you! I swear to God! Look, you see that now! See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision, then scan it. Chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. It's pretty cool. Yeah. 
Impressive, right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. <laughs> anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? No way. Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when... Oh, yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T-Bug to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who? Runner for my crew. Security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Judy, T-Bug's a professional, discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Because you say so? Please, Judy. I'd never expose you to any danger. You know that. Okay, V. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey, V. What's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Compeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Compeki? Oh, I thought as much. Someone there with you? Judy and Evelyn, they're chill. They're helping me work through this BD. Uh-huh. All right. You gonna tell me what this is about? Listen, need your help. Got no clue what to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking it to your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Got it. You ready? A millisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice, and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire up, Judy. Nothing yet. You look like. And you are. Shit, cameras packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. Probably nothing else yet, huh? Oh, I mean, there's this. Alarm firmware is fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling to this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Okay. You can't fuck a meat, are you? Hell, oh, cheese. She. I felt a fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. Oh, nothing here, really. Not yet, at least. Must be a clue here that I'm just not getting. Leaving signal range. Okay. Why can't I do anything with this guy? We already analyzed this. We already analyzed this. We got this. Hmm. Let's see. Okay. 
Alright, well, it doesn't look like I'm finding anything yet. I said no. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for Okay. Look around a little bit. Here in a drone. Ventilation and cooling. Servers. Gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. Good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute. Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Finish. We shall see soon enough. in a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks My father's involved. a tired, visionless old graybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. We'll listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we won't now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no, provide right. them. In Heard that? Relic docks gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. All right. A moment, it will pass. Hmm. I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus on me. What's this? Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. Systems all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. Okay. Can't get around them ourselves? Nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. I'm gonna check something else out. Shaz, how do I do that? Wait, so let's play for a little bit longer. Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom, nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. Very nice. But come here already. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah. Uh, You'll 
Oh. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Data pad. Bunch of storage. Manual details a special temp controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. Hmm. So, Chip's got to stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where you are know who's keeping the chip. Okay. Hmm. Oops. Uh, I think I need to maybe look backward a little bit. All right. So let's go back. Hold on, hold on. Oh, Donaghy's. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. <laughs> really think you'll find the chip in there? Probably not. No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. Hmm. What? Wait, okay. We're in a range. Something. Just a fancy ass fridge. Oh. Well. Tip doesn't match the guidelines. Won't find a thing here. Hmm? Grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Yorinobu's got the case here. Guaranteed. Okay. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. All right. Nice. Get everything you need? <sighs> yep. That'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. Cool. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Oh, thanks. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. Relax, I got it all under control. If you fuck up and they come knocking on my door, Judy, relax. That's not gonna happen. Evelyn, please, no shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. Well, that was fun. Let's walk. Well, what do you think? Intel on Yorinobu, the chip, the BD from Kompeki. Winds are right. The plan's perfect. A job like this comes one in a million. Hmm. Thanks. Now the punchline, please. Just sounds too good to be true. What's the catch? Cold feet. Are you looking to get out of it? I want to know if you're really in control here. You're not sending me into the sort of shit I can't wait out of. V, 
I have zero reasons to haze you. We're in this together. Really. Trust me that I got this. You're not worried? Our sock will flag and screen anyone who's had dealings with Yorinobu. Oh, they'll have a long list then. Packed full of big names. Much bigger than mine. You tell me who they check first. Corpo hotshots and cutthroats? Or a little bedroom plaything like me? I think I see how you know so much about Yorinobu. It's simple. Men like Pillow talk a bit too much. So it's just about the sex? Biz. And biz only. So, what now? V. Do this job for me. I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. Hmm. You want to fuck over our fixer? I knew something was up. Dex is a middleman. And a useless one at this point. Evelyn, you don't mess with fixers. That's the one rule every merc in this city knows. And actually follows. But if we're smart... Doesn't matter. A mistake like that will cost you your rep. And without a rep, you're nobody. You sure you want to do this? Better ask yourself that question. Do you want to spend the rest of your days blasting scabs? Or become a legend overnight? Your choice. Not this character. If I agree, there'll be hell to pay for sure. I know. Whatever you decide, it stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. <sighs> Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Thanks. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. Alright. Hey, more perk points. And an attribute point. Look at that. Of course! You can count on me, babe. How are things looking, Mr. V? Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. We're all set. Ready to go. What now? Now we do the job I hired you to do. Grabbing that biochip. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Great. Be there in no time. See you, Mr. V. Okay. I'd like to leave, please. Oh. This is the way out, huh? 4 a.m. last night, Gina and Lisa in the car. And she's rattling on about the bank stuff, yada, yada, yada. The heist is next. Going in or staying out? Oh, I'm done. Thanks. Okay. Well, next up is the heist. Bart Moss Collective. Okay. I just got a spam message or something. In any case. So, get another attribute point, huh? I think I'm done with intelligence in terms of what I want to be able to do. Like, I might max these out, but not really interested in these. This is not a Netrunner character. Got what we need in cool. I think it's time to boost up reflexes some more. We'll slowly work our way there. So last time we got this. Now I think we should start working on some more um, cold blood stacks. For instance, will to survive. Pretty good one. <laughs> 